Hey everyone, I'm Valentin from BM Trading Bulgaria. You're finding me on Jarvis's Terrace. It's uh, very cool here. As you can see on the background is the barbecue. We made one, uh, I think it was uh, two weeks ago or maybe one, I don't really remember, but it was a very cool experience. And uh, next week we're going to make one for sure. So be ready for nice and cool posts. Today, I wanted to share with you one of my last trades and to make a trade dissection on it. But first, let's go inside and check the graph. So we're inside and now, as you can see on the graph that I'm going to show now on your screens, this is the US oil. This is uh, the graph from uh, 24th of July. It's on one hour time frame. And uh, the main thing that I wanted to show you here is that uh, I've drawn this uh, uptrend channel. After that, the main idea was to enter into long position and to, to hold it. Uh, that was actually on uh, 22nd or 23rd, I'm not uh, entirely sure, I think 23rd of uh, uh, July. Uh, yeah, as you can see here is uh, the number. So just before it, I was uh, I entered into a long position. This was my stop loss and uh, the idea was to hold the trade till it reaches uh, this resistance area here and to close at least 50% of it and uh, maybe even uh, the whole exposure. But uh, the main mistake that I made here was that uh, uh, I uh, worried too much that uh, my stop loss was uh, going to be hit and uh, whenever I saw this big red candle that was on the next day after I opened the trade so it stays uh, one day overnight, actually one night uh, during the night overnight uh, I told that uh, my stop loss is going to be hit anyway so I closed it uh, a little bit before it. Maybe I was driven by emotions or I just wanted to uh, minimize uh, the loss with uh, several euro. But uh, what actually happened is that uh, on the next candle, it uh, stays uh, on the same level. Uh, it was a green one. Then it consolidated a little bit. And as you can see, it fails to break the trend channel. And in the night on uh, 24th of July, it started to rise rapidly. Of course, there was data which helps with the uh, uh, buying pressure but uh, nevertheless the most important thing is that it uh, reaches the uh, target and instead of uh, realizing a loss here I could have uh, uh, actually realized a very nice profit and my uh, initial plan was uh, going to be fulfilled which means that uh, my stop loss was uh, perfectly located so I just had to trust my plan but uh, sometimes the emotions are making you to, uh, make, uh, to take irrational decisions which uh, usually affects your uh, winnings and actually in the long run these irrational decisions could cost you a lot. Those are the main analysis from the trade uh, that I made on the US oil. I hope uh, even though you follow it uh, perfectly with the levels that I sent on my initial trading signal so you managed to realize very nice profit from it. For me, I'm uh, looking forward to the next trade and I'm going to learn from my mistakes and uh, not repeat them. Of course, if you want to watch more of our free education of videos and uh, the advices that we're giving for, uh, for the trading sphere, you can always subscribe to our YouTube channel and check all of other social media accounts like Facebook and Instagram because a lot of free content we are posting there and it might be interesting and very useful for you. Thank you very much for your attention. Good luck with your trading and see you again next time. Bye bye.